when I was at MIT doing my entrepreneurial uh, master's program, the woman who founded the, uh, the, the little Roomba, little vacuum cleaner and things, stuff like that, she actually lived here in Clear Lake, by the way. She worked for NASA. And you know, she just wanted to make robots. And then she's just, you know, all right, well, we'll start a robot company. She goes out and starts a robot company. She spends 17 years raising money, not building robots, not being some genius, not getting to do the things that she woke up every day being all totally excited. No, she raised money. And then when she ran out of money, she raised more money. And then she raised more money. And she raised more money. And then they did a project. And they did, learned a little bit. And they had a couple failures. And they did some other things. And they had some failures. And they learned. And boom, boom. And then all of a sudden, Roomba. Boom. $525 million market capitalization. Now they have so much cash in the bank, it literally pays their entire payroll for the year just on the interest. So overnight success sensation, just like we've all heard about, right? 17 years of raising capital. It's a wonderful thing but you gotta have it.